Okay, as promised, here's uh, here's Rod, Saginaw, Michigan. Rod, you're first. Great to have you on the uh, EIB network today. Hello. Hey, Mega Mega Diddles Rush. Uh, I've been a long-time listener since 1990, and it's a true honor to speak with you right now. Thank I you, sir. You Thank you. Thank you. Very much. I appreciate that. You are the man. Hey, listen, uh, I need your help on something, and I and I, I mean this very sincerely. I'm in a, I'm, here, I'm really in a true pickle right now that I think you are the only one that can help me. All right. You know, and you teed it up perfect earlier. Earlier in the show here, you explained about the effects um, when Oprah endorsed Obama, the effects of that situation. And as you know, mixing politics with business can be a slippery slope. And this is where I need your help. Um, I need to know how you can continue to support the Pittsburgh Steelers, even though you know that owner Art Rooney dedicated their last Super Bowl trophy to Obama. The reason why I need to really embrace this and understand this is because I'm in a very similar situation here in Michigan. I've been a full season ticket holder for Detroit Tigers for close to 10 years, and I've been a fan my whole life. I grew up in the Detroit area. I used to take my paper out money, go down to Old Tiger Stadium and buy some bleacher seats. Um, and I did that my whole life. I've been a fan my whole life. And Mike Gillich, he owns the he owns Little Caesars Pizza. For some of you that don't know that, Mike Gillich, he owns Little Caesars Pizza, and he's also the owner of the Detroit Tigers in Detroit. Okay, Tigers. I'm down to one minute. If you could okay. get to the nub of it. All right. Well, here's the deal. Um, Gillich has been a great owner, but his daughter Denise, who is extremely involved in the business, um, and probably will take over, invited Obama to her house last week for a fundraiser. Um, and Mike Gillich is great. I support him. He's done a great job with the Detroit Tigers, and he's revolutionized the city of Detroit, brought back the Tiger baseball. People are excited about it. But I'm personally having a problem supporting the Detroit Tigers organization as they are. In See, okay. Obama. So you got the owner's wife doing a fundraiser for Obama. You're a big Tigers fan. It's sort of depressed. You don't. You don't really. Uh... Yeah, you don't you, you you don't you don't feel right being a Tigers fan anymore, right? Well, it's not that I don't feel right about it. I don't know how to handle it moving forward. Like I said, Mike Gillich is a great owner. I had a tremendous amount of respect for him, but this kind of threw me a curveball. You know, I'm a true conservative, and it, it's kind of mixing my head. Do up. not I need your help. let Barack Obama destroy the love you have for the Detroit Tigers. Because it's the team that you like. Owners come and go. The team is the Detroit Tigers. That's the way I would look at it. I wouldn't pay it any mind. You can't. You're, you're not going to be able to avoid this kind of stuff throughout life. By this time, you ought to never ever go to a movie. By the way, listen to what the left doesn't want you to hear. Rush on the EIB Network.